The European Commission's Joint Research Center is working on introducing the principles of the three R's replacement, reduction and refinement of animal use for scientific purposes in primary and secondary education. Teachers across Europe and beyond, coordinated by the European Schoolnet, have tested the newly developed 3Rs learning scenarios and additional resources. In this video, teachers will share their impressions and recommendations from the experience. To integrate the 3Rs materials, I used the lesson connected to biology physics, ethics, and economics. These topics are interdisciplinary and encourage connections between the subject and educational fields. We were speaking with students about laboratory research, computational modeling, ethical studies, animal rights, legislation, and other interesting topics. The material I implemented also engaged students in career research. They get an opportunity to practice strategic thinking and analytical skills while supporting information processing and creating presentation skills. The three arts lesson helped to incorporate new words and expand the vocabulary of my students. Moreover, these real-life and practical topics help move the focus on the real discussions and solutions without paying much attention to language barriers. Everyone wanted to express themselves and this topic made even passive students speak in class. Therefore, I would say that topics such as the three R's helped to better teach my subject and even added interest in it since there are a lot of interesting materials available on the topic in English. Teaching the three R's allowed my students to look at astronomy and physics from another perspective. When faced with the question, using animals in testing can be beneficial for human health, but is it ethical? Students have an opportunity to practice their critical thinking and problem-solving skills. As a result, their interest and love for science and technology have increased. The three R's topics allowed me to somehow break the everyday routines of my lessons. In other words, over time, students become reluctant to participate in standard exercises. But this material helped me bring new and practical issues to classroom, which engaged everyone in the class. During the lesson, I can say that my students improved their speaking skills when debating animal use and testing. This gave them an opportunity to speak about something real and relatable. In addition to English skills, they also practiced critical thinking and enhanced their science literacy skills. For example, when researching information for the debate, last but not less important, they understood how to be an active citizenship and put it into practice. 